Okay, okay. So the awesome thing about Looper is Bruce Willis is him from the future, right? It's really interesting. I'm actually planning on seeing it myself. Okay, okay. That's not the actual cool part. That's just the setup for the actual cool part. Where did the movie last night? Okay, the actual cool part is that he is in fact... Wait! <laughs> Don't spoil that movie. Dire consequences await you if you do. Who the hell are you? I'm you. From the future. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Why don't the two of you look alike? In the future, everybody looks like this. <gasps> it's just one of the horrible consequences of spoiling that movie. Wait, wait. I, I don't see how telling her is that... Well, I can't even say... Yeah. Well, what about... Jose, no way! I can't even tell no. her... No! I, I just was going to tell her about that. Would <laughs> lead to such a horrible future. Well, first, an eagle comes and attacks you. An eagle. Yes, an eagle. This sets off a bizarre and strange sequence of events, ending in... What?! Oh, come on. <laughs> Don't spoil that bizarre and strange sequence of events! I wasn't planning on spoiling that. I think she means me. Oh. If but... you do, complete donkey tits will happen! Is the yelling necessary? Just, just, she balls from here till Tuesday! Get it? Goat balls and horse sneak is raining from the sky! Wait, wait. Is she being metaphorical? Or is that, is that something that actually, does, does a barnyard explode? <laughs> How do we even know she's from the future? Oh. She just walked in here. She could be some crazy homeless drifter. <laughs> Not only am I from the future, I'm you from the future. <gasps> And is everyone in the future deaf because the yelling seems unnecessary? That's your concern here? Not the gender swap? Well, I assume that sort of thing is pretty fluid in the future. Gender changes, cybernetic implants... Complete donkey tits! Yeah, those two. No! I have to go back to the future I left my oven on! Hey, uh, could I catch a ride? You can drop me anywhere in the Kardashian presidency. Yeah, sure, whatever. You might have read up the zoo and see some cows. Sure, I guess I'm up for some nostalgia. Sweet, parked over there. <laughs> that is exactly what happens in Looper. Oh God! No! We are a comedy group here in Lafayette. Um, yeah. All right. Okay, so we're, we're going to do a show for you tonight. It's going to be pretty fun. But as you see, I'm just going to hold on. Fix it, man. This guy with the... All right. So we're going to do a show for you tonight. Um, we are mostly an improv group, but as you see, we're going to do some sketch tonight. Uh, unveiling for the first time for you. So for the special, I know it's very exciting. Um, so we're going to get started with our first improv set. And to do that, we're going to need some volunteers because we want to, you know, it's, it's the Valentine holiday season it's a couple days ago. And so can we get some people up here to interview, uh, maybe about your Valentine, so a couple maybe, two people, so uh, maybe, uh, you know, there's no couples in the audience, no one uh, celebrating the first Valentine's Day. Can we, maybe two random people who want to meet? <laughs> okay, well, there's one, and, okay. and there's two, okay, all right, you two. Two people, right. I'm gonna make them! Oh, could you guys come up on the side of the That's That's blocked by it. Kind of blocked by our extremely sophisticated audio technology. Mm. <laughs> so, uh, since we don't have an actual couple, I'll just use the same questions I had before. Oh, I see you guys. What's your name? Steve. Steven, what's your name? Caleb. Steven and Caleb, all right. Thank you. So how'd you guys meet? Well, it was a strange circumstance. It was yeah. really rainy, and he was the only person with an umbrella. It just went out. <laughs> <crazy. laughs> it's so yeah. romantic. Yeah. How, uh... it, it really was. That was one of the most beautiful nights of my life. It's amazing. Uh, was this your first Valentine's Day? <sighs> yes. Ever? Yeah. Well, I've lived through 20 Valentine's Day, but wow, this 20. is the only Valentine's 20, Day. 20 I've Valentine's Day. Day. Yeah, 
course, I thought you meant in the sense of, but. <laughs> no, no, I, maybe I should go off script. Uh, so, um, <laughs> how about that meteorite, huh? No one? Yeah. 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 Shit, right? Explosions. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. It's crazy. World's ending. All over the place. Do you have a question? World's ending. No. Um, <laughs> I have a lot of couples-based questions. Um, yeah. So, are you guys looking for love? I'm. I've been looking, but basically in all the wrong places. I keep going to libraries, bookstores, churches, and I can only find like crazy going... people there. I or looked in the fridge; it wasn't there either. <laughs> <laughs> if you find love in the fridge, Jeffrey Dahmer, I think we need to find out other places. Um, so, what sort of places do you think you should look for love? Well, honestly, I think a, a flower shop would get, be a good choice. A lot of smart people hang out there, but mostly maybe the old folks' home. <laughs> I think I picked the wrong people. <laughs> Refrigerator can in an I, old folks home. Can, can I say under yes. an umbrella? Under just an umbrella. To, just to, you know, even under this Look, thing out. So find a random umbrella. Lonely Look person alone it. on the umbrella. Find that. Yeah. All right, that's, that's yeah. good. Thank you guys for so much. <laughs> Let's give him a hand. Uh, exhausting this white person. All right, thank you very much. What we're going to do is sort of use their responses to my very good questions. To sort of influence our stuff that we do. And so if we can have two people to start the first scene, we'll get started. Then we'll... It's a pretty small umbrella. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm a pretty small person. I'm a... Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, boy. Uh, listen, I, uh... I'm really, like, I'm really busy. For, like, I'm too busy for a commitment. I'm, uh, I'm not ready for this. It's okay. I'm not, I like, I wasn't looking for love. You don't have to be looking for love. Oh, it. gosh. Do you want to meet the oh, I would love to. <laughs> <laughs> it's not in there. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Look harder. <laughs> no, I do not see the love. <laughs> Look, move, move the checks. Find it. Okay, checks. <laughs> I think the checks are talking. <laughs> you think I'd repeat what I got you last year? Show me that. Open it. It's heavy. <laughs> just, just open it. Okay. You're out of money. You don't have any money left. Do you got me my me. mother? In oh, checks. Yeah. <laughs> I think we should let him out at least. No. He's good for another few. Uh, yeah, okay, take him out. <laughs> See, I cloned you. Not kept him in the straight for this planet. Yeah, they talked about it last week. But I, I mean, do you want to see it? <laughs> I already saw it on CNN. Mildred, I paid six million dollars for this telescope. <laughs> Show me that purchase. <laughs> I've only got pennies. <laughs> okay, well, um... <laughs> it's six million dollars. Okay, that's wheelbarrow number one. Go back! But Mildred, I've discovered something. That everybody else already discovered. No, 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 no! I'm breaking up with you. Listen, I, uh, 
I'm not, I can't meet your parents. I, oh, I have a report to write for work. Can I, hey, here? Can I share that umbrella? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. I, listen, this is, okay, this is, <laughs> we, this is moving too fast for me. Uh, it's really, it's a one person umbrella. Do you want to meet my parents? Oh, no. yes. <laughs> no. Do you want to meet mine? Yes. I, do you want to meet mine? I, no, I, this, <laughs> I'm an orphan just looking for a home. Oh. <laughs> so this is your 16th birthday, right? You had, you had 15 before this. That's right, 16, this is, sweet 16. This is your first one with me. Correct, this is my first 16th birthday with you. And this is your only 16th birthday with me. Correct. So basically, this is like our anniversary birthday. <laughs> it is like that. That's so what do you do? Get me for my... Oh, I'll show you that later. Can we continue talking about how great our love is? Our love is fairly great. <laughs> you got me a violin and a mariachi band? Keep telling me how great I am. Well, for one... Oh my gosh! This is amazing! You're running late. <laughs> All my favorite types of music. Okay, 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 okay. Now that we're broken up. Don't look. touch me. Sorry, okay. But look, the meteor's moving faster. It's attracted to single people. <laughs> so you broke up with me so that we would both die. Well, I mean, it's going to kill the entire planet, but it's attracted to the single people. So, the only way to save ourselves. Can, you, can I share that telescope with you? He paid six million dollars for it. I just, I don't have one. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess now that I'm single, yeah, anyone can look at my telescope they want. So, Robbie number one, we're together Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Robbie number two, Beeper, Tuesday, Beeper. Thursday, Saturday, Beeper. and Sunday. I think something went wrong with the cloning there. Yeah. Well, Harper, Harper inner monologue, the clone. It was a rainy day in March. My mother went into labor at 4.59 p.m. The cows in the barn kicked over a lantern. Started the great Chicago fire. Go back. It's just like you. Burr, burr, burr. Yes. <laughs> that means he likes you. Only on Sunday, though. What does that mean about He's our... mine today. I thought we were going to paint pottery. <laughs> Hank, have a seat. Yeah, you can just set the violin down there. You're not going to be needing it anymore. <laughs> it, Hank, the band asked me to talk to you. Is this because of the Brahms? Because I don't have to play Brahms. <laughs> Hank, you're a mariachi band. I'm not even sure who Brahms is. <laughs> Hank, there's no space. I forgot. I forgot all about it. Oscar winning moment. I, I could do better! Hank, there's no place for Mozart or Bach. <laughs> I don't know what I've been doing with my life. <clears throat> Managing a mariachi band that has been subpar at best. I'm when tired. I, when I was a kid, I wanted to climb mountains. I'm new tired. Choice. When I was a child, I wanted to climb mountains. What a new choice. When I was a little boy, I wanted to climb mountains. <laughs> new choice. When I was a tot, I wanted to climb mountains. <laughs> I can't believe you kicked all of us out of the band instead. Yeah, come on. Word. I don't know how to do anything else. I do. I can play like ten instruments. I can play this guitar, that's it. You, let's not get ahead of ourselves. You can hold the guitar. I play it. 
Uh. <laughs> You've learned that note very well, but I, it's not a song. No, it's a song when combined with you guys. <laughs> Wiki wiki! Right. Brum, brum, Guys, we brum. should go into business for ourselves. Take take that damn violence down. Robbie, I'm glad you decided to meet with me. I wanted to tell you how I feel about what's going on. I don't feel appreciated anymore. It's like I'm not needed. Do you feel that way at all? I mean, you're being split. So, yes. Inner monologue, the clone. <laughs> Tuesday, 49 hours left to go. Normandy. <laughs> Mildred, I've run some calculations. Great. <laughs> we have to start dating. What was that? We have to start. Sorry, I couldn't hear you. We have to start dating again. I can't hear you anymore. The earth is doomed. That really hurt. You broke up with me. You ever. broke my leg. I'm glad. Just enough love in this world to repel that meteor. But not enough love for you to get back with me. No, I want to get back with you to save the world. Guys, I think it's time to take this to the next level. I don't. I, we, we, there's... we should get a puppy. Oh, God. I already have one. <laughs> I'll pick you a pocket. I've become Cockney. <laughs> It's well, a, I, listen, a I, big we're already bro, there. Listen, oh I have to. Oh, 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 got a quarter? Oh, 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 do you want to meet my parents? Quarter? You want to meet my parents? Do you want to pet our puppy? New brother smells bad. Guys, I have a report to write for work. It's due in an hour. But it's raining. Quarters? Just put puppy on your report. I had a talk with Robbie, number two. He understood. He's you getting along step, now? He's gonna step back. He's, step he's leaving. He's going to college. <laughs> Show me that! <laughs> this essay just says puppy. Oh my. How far? Oh, Mr. Blobberson, this is very inappropriate. Inner monologue clone. <laughs> the meteor was 11,700 miles away. But I was still here. <laughs> I didn't have a telescope. So I fashioned one out of a roll of cardboard and some dew. Show me that. <laughs> I am so sorry I'm late, sir. Okay, um... Make it tolerate this kind of crap? Listen, I have I have the report half written, and I have this puppy. Half written gets you half fired. Ha okay, so... <laughs> So I'm just part time now. Oh my God, the puppy works. Oh God, I need to. You can be the president now. Here's my ID. Just, just, 
Oh, oh. <laughs> Sherpa, get out here! Today is the day we make the final ascent. Wow, we've waited all our lives for this. Since you were a tot. Can I use that Sherpa with you? Um... I don't have one. Do you want to meet my parents? No. Do you want to meet his parents? I don't... No, don't, don't hug the Sherpa. Don't hug the Sherpa. You can meet his parents. I mean, I brought them with... There's the summit, but we can go back there. Why can't I get away from you people? Here, bring it in. It's just, I really wanted to climb the top of this mountain and stop the meteor from killing us all. But I guess we could just stand here. I was gonna hold up this puppy to it. This is, this is an offering of cuteness. Yeah, yeah. But I guess we can... We got a band now. We don't need anything else. Well, I'd like to stay and have a planet to live on. That's asking too much. <laughs> Chelsea, I think this love's old. It's, it's yours, right? What are you trying to say? The, the, the love in there. It's been there like four weeks. It's still good. Look at those knots. Yeah, it is. Bite it. Sniff it. <laughs> Sniff it. <laughs> yeah, no, fresh as can be. I can't. <laughs> Have some. I'm not going to eat this. You know you want to. No, I don't. <clears throat> you wanted to three weeks ago. Show me three weeks ago. Do you want to eat? <laughs> okay, you're welcome to eat it. Oh, you know, I was, you know, I was desperate then. Uh, uh, really uh, hungry. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> oh, you built a paper tube. <laughs> Inner monologue to clone. <laughs> With my new gravity gun that I made out of toothpicks and dental floss, I show me that the asteroid. <laughs> oh, he's making us a Valentine, Robbie. Oh Go back <laughs> away from the planet, saving all of mankind. <laughs> See that. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's our first line one. Hey, you know that movie Seven? Yeah. yeah. You know the, the head in the box, the end of Seven, actually Gwyneth Paltrow's head. <laughs> I don't think that's true, man. No, for real. David Fincher wanted to use a fake one. But Gwyndog said, F it, chop it off. <laughs> she has been in movies since then, though. That, that's, no that's worries, bro. They sort of back on. The only problem was, you know, the severed head, so it goes all babbling crazy like, so they had to stuff her mouth with peanut butter. <laughs> no, they did not. No. Dude, it showed up on camera. They had to CGI it out. They had to invent CGI to CGI it out. <laughs> Barry, th this is exactly why nobody wants to work bomb disposal crew with you. I'm just saying, Guy Vinsky. Gwyneth Paltrow's method. Now, you can see those tools. Let's get this splode dog diffused. <laughs> Oh, get knocked down! 
Boy, get up again. You're never gonna keep me down. Oh, get knocked out. Who sings that? Oh. 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 <sighs> like a good neighbor, State Farm is there! <laughs> like a good neighbor, State Farm is there! <laughs> like a good neighbor, State Farm is there! Ah, comrade! <laughs> ah, you are here to see crops and money for State Farm, yes? <laughs> what? No, what? I, I crashed my car. Ah, Kampatnik, do not worry. Our car is sound and also safe. I used this morning to take go to hospital. He has the bad rash. <laughs> no, I want to talk to my agent. Where is Christy, my agent? Agent! Kaboruski, why are you not telling me so, you are big time government man? Come, see how many crops I have collected for Republic. I have big help, yes? That is a lot of. No, this is stupid. I want to file a claim. Yes, yes, claim! Claim for the good of the everyone. Without the rest, the horse doesn't get gallop. Without effort, you can get pull fish from pond. <laughs> What are you talking about? Ah, he's old saying. Come, come. I show you big time donkey carts. We used to pull goat when car is broken. Like a good neighbor, Christy is there. <laughs> like a good neighbor, Christy is there. <laughs> Christy! <laughs> Christy! <laughs> Okay, hopefully you enjoyed that, because it was pretty great from where I was, where I couldn't see anything and I could only hear what was going on. It was pretty great. Um, we're going to go back to improv really quick um, and do a game where we need two audience volunteers. I'm not going to tell you what the game is, you just have to trust that you'll be okay. we got one back there in the back. Let's come on up. And then, oh, it's so hard to decide. Right there on the, and with the, with the V, and the, yeah. Or him, that's cool. All right. Oh, all right. What's your name? Hi, how's it going? Jason. Jason, everybody. Jason, everybody. And where's what's your name? Happened to. Oh, okay. We're switching around. Come on. Up. He's really excited. Hi, what's your name? Uh, my name's Lauren. 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 Yeah. Lauren. Lauren, everybody. Lauren. Okay, this game is called Word Bank. We're gonna have our two. Um, members here doing a scene, and they're going to be at a loss for words every once in a while, and they're going to indicate to their uh, bank, their bank people, to fill in the gaps. And what you'll see is what happens when we don't pay attention in primary school. So can I get a suggestion of something that you found attractive about your significant other last week? Love dances. What, sorry? Love dances. <coughs> I heard laugh dances. Laugh, laugh, dances. laugh dances. I heard laugh, laughing dances. Laugh. Something about laughter and dancing. I don't know. Oh, it's crazy. Go ahead. Can you believe how expensive those laugh dances are? I can. They were worth every penny. I told you not to waste your money on that type of. <laughs> that type of can of oil. That type of can of oil. You're just gonna rust out anyway. <laughs> gonna burn off in a blaze of glory, and no one's even gonna remember your figure skating. Your figure skating. Well, <laughs> that can of oil has really improved my figure skating, and it has also helped my a hearing. My hearing. What was that, Mom? You love my laugh dances. Mom loves my laugh They're dances. They're making you go crazy. What are you gonna do next? Are you gonna go buy a bunch of puppies? Puppies? Because that's the kind of crazy I want in a roommate. Oh my god! Oh! I got you this box of puppies. <laughs> I got you this puppies because I 
hate your guts. I hate you so much. <laughs> what? <No. laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? I'll tell you what the hell is wrong with me. I have a seizures. <laughs> I have a seizures. <laughs> you gotta put a spoon in your mouth or else you'll just... Die of cancer like my grandmother. Die of cancer like my grandmother. <laughs> Listen, this is getting too morbid. Can't we just go back to... Playing? Playing. No, I don't want to play anymore. You waste my money on your oil and then and, and you, you do that to a bunch of puppies. Look at what the oil Who do you think you, you do? <laughs> Good God. This is how I got... Laid. Laid. <laughs> no. Yep. That's how you're going yep. to get laid. That, it's how I got laid, and it's how I'm going to get laid again in the future. Oh, I see what you're saying. We're... Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And scene! <laughs> Big round of applause for Jason and Sloan, please. Please don't die. I'm trying not to. Well, please don't die. <laughs> Has this ever happened to you? Yeah. Boy, Janie, my comedy show is going really well. But I wish you could hold a satirical mirror up to today's marketing practices. Well, Bob, have you considered fake commercial? Fake commercial? What the heck is that? Oh, Bob, Mr. Announcer! That's right, Janie. Whether you want to skewer a popular fan, mock a celebrity's public persona, or just add an extra surreal layer to your premise, Fake commercial has you covered. But, but Mr. Announcer, how does that work? Bob, you dummy. It's simple as can be. You see, fake commercial works by making fun of the most seen, least liked aspects of American culture. Real commercials. Oh man, I hate those. <laughs> you sure do, dummy. You see, the rhythms of commercials are so ingrained in the minds of the average TV viewers that you can say almost anything in a fake commercial, as long as you hear to the right cadence. But Mr. Announcer, what if the fake commercial hasn't been popular in the past 30 years and exists only in the cultural lexicon as its duplicate? Jenny, that doesn't matter at all. In fact, fake commercial comes in a variety of handy flavors. Why, their celebrity endorsement. I'm a famous celebrity. <laughs> the product I'm endorsing <laughs> and the manner of my endorsement juxtapose humorously with my carefully crafted public image or a recent scandal I'm involved in. <laughs> Political ads! Hi, I'm a politician and I've got some opinions. <laughs> they sound reasonable, but quickly descend into complete silliness. Often I'm revealed to be a violent, dangerous psychopath. This is funny because of our cultural distrust of supposed public servants. And even feminine hygiene ads. Hi, I'm a woman. The natural functions of my body make male viewers incredibly uncomfortable. So much so that even slightly breaking the reality of ads that help me deal with my vagina make them burst into gales of nervous, insecure laughter. <laughs> This is indistinguishable from real laughter, so it counts. <laughs> That's right, fake commercial. For when creativity is just too hard. Durr. Oh, Bob. You, you dummy. dummy! And now, new meta fake commercial. For when explaining the joke is funnier than just telling it. Your audience won't laugh, but they will think, hmm, that's clever. <laughs> Hi, we're back. So we're going to do some more improv for you. I know you're excited. Woo! Thank you, thank you. So during the first uh, long form set, you may have noticed us using some calls such as show me that, where we acted out something you've heard of. I'm going to frisbee this out to somebody. <gasps> so, uh, Troy, so, Troy! Oh. 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 Bad catch. Now you might have also heard Oscar winning moments. Oscar winning really moments! <laughs> Slightly Close. better catch. And inner monologue. Inner yes. monologue! Yes. Yes. Right, yes. 
I'm gonna All go the way out there. Here it comes. Holy! Don't hit it. Kill shot. Be careful. Now, use the calls whenever you like. Feel free to pass them around. If you've got the paddle, you've got the power. So feel free to use it. Now, we're gonna start this one off a little differently with some monologues. So can I get a suggestion of an item that you received as a present, not on Valentine's Day, but like a week beforehand? Yeah. Yeah. Banana. I heard, I heard uh, banana, and I love that as a present, so let's go with <laughs> So my name is Shanna, and the only word in the English language that anybody can remember it rhyming with is banana. Um, I have had to basically, in every class that I've ever had, tell the teacher, hi, I'm Shanna, like banana, but spelled different, obviously. And they, ne they never remember my name. I have a British teacher named Siggy, who every single time that she says my name says Shauna, because in England, it's banana. And she unfortunately remembered it wrong. And we've, I've, I've taken her class for three years. She's my mentor. She's the one who's going to basically sign off my diploma. And she still calls me Shauna. Uh, so a couple years ago, I had a Chinese roommate. And um, he cooked a lot. He was a really, really great cook. Um, you know the story already, if you're laughing. Um, so he, he cooked a lot, really great cook, and then for his birthday, he invited all of his Chinese friends over. They were all Chinese, and he made a bunch of Chinese food for them. And me and another friend, we were the only two Americans there, and he decided to make one classic American dish for us, or what he thought was a classic American dish, Bananas wrapped in bacon. <laughs> and he had them out and he was like, this is for you guys. This is, this is what you guys like. We're like, oh yeah. And I mean, it wound up being really good because I typically hate bananas, but I actually really wound up liking them when they were wrapped in bacon, which makes me a really cliche American, I guess. <laughs> Morgan, Morgan, have a seat. <laughs> oh God, game day. Ooh, game day. All right. Okay. Yeah. What's All the right. game? What are we playing? <laughs> I brought Monopoly. It's it's Super Bowl, son. <laughs> Super Bowl. <laughs> Morgan, I'm gonna tell you a secret. Oh. I don't like you. Oh. <laughs> but my wife likes you. Hey. Show me that. <clears throat> Hi, Morgan. Oh. <laughs> Is that my favorite dish? It is, in fact, your favorite dish. And on it is bacon. <laughs> yeah, I'm allergic. Oh, that's too bad. Would you like me to get you an EpiPen? <laughs> Aren't those illegal? Not in this house. Go back. <laughs> she won't stop raving about you. you no, know, she wanted to give me one of them, uh, one of them, uh, I don't know. It's like a pen. She wanted, to, she wanted to give you stationery. Yeah, I think so. I don't understand that at all, but she told me I had to have you over for my big party. Oh. Take, take, take a seat, plus. I am your professor, and before anyone has any questions, yes, I am in fact British. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's start with something simple. Can anybody tell me uh, when, uh, uh, yes, Brotney. <laughs> yes, Brotney. I just want to make sure you call me first. I want to hear the rest of the question. Okay, Brotney. Um, inner monologue teacher. <laughs> oh dear God, I forgot to create a lesson plan. I don't have anything to teach. Also, I'm not British. I just got nervous. And I, I was watching Downton Abbey last night. <laughs> and so I talked in this accent. <sighs> yes, Char Charlie. <laughs> Sir, is it a banana? <laughs> yes, Charlie. Banana is, is banana. Banana, <laughs> banana is a dish that I like. I like in things, but not by itself. I don't like to eat banana by itself. Right. 
Uh, but I like it in ice cream and pudding. Uh, well, pu ice cream is a pudding because I'm British, and in, in Britain, all puddings are dessert, but not necessarily pudding. Yes, Brotney. Can we, can we have pudding in class? Oh, uh, is it your birth birthday? Oh, well, I thought you could bring some in just because. It's my birthday. Yes. It's his birthday pudding. Yes, Arnold. Come <laughs> ask Andrew. I think Morgan stole Oscar winning moment. <laughs> my heart. <laughs> well, you're too late. Because you stole my heart, too. I've lived my whole life without the grim specter of love. <laughs> Our marriage of convenience has meant little to nothing to me. We've had five children. Show me that. Suicide. Not again. <laughs> Never seen anything like this in years. <laughs> Damn it, Dylan. Inner monologue, Dylan. <laughs> hey, what's 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 I don't have a gun. You never gave me one. Good. That was one good thing we did. Can I have a gun? No! No! Go back! No. Go back. <laughs> well, let's see. Shoot, we can examine these bodies. Come on. Hey. Oh my god. Look at that. He's got no heart. His chest just opens up like a like a cabinet. Hey, yeah. Someone stole it. This one's a girl. I've seen this before. <laughs> Happened to my own wife. Mine too. Don't worry, we're gonna get this son of a bitch. We have to. Yeah. Hey, uh, Dylan! Come on, well, this hey, it's a girl, so. What would you make him do? Reverse! What would you make him do? Forward! Yeah, Look what you're making him do! Jesus. Are you, are you looking at him? <laughs> well, a little bit. I'm, gonna, I'm just investigating, you know? Dylan, give me a hand. I want to tell you guys another story. Woo! <laughs> Inspired by my good friend Mike. Um, so I had a friend who, when he would get really drunk, he would just uncontrollably talk in this British accent. And he was pretty good at it because he spent the first like 10 years of his life in Britain. Um, so I mean, he had it down. But this happened one night when he was out drinking and he was talking to this girl when he was ordering pizza and she actually became really attracted to him because of it and he wound up asking her on a date and he kept up that British accent for three dates <laughs> before just breaking it off with her because he couldn't come clean and say that he didn't actually normally speak in a British accent. How so you really? Oi, uh, yes, um, welcome to my office hours. Uh, let, let, let me just turn off my, my telly, uh, mate. I was oh my god, that's what they're saying. 
I was I was watching Downton Abbey. It reminds me of uh, me mom. <laughs> so this might be a little presumptuous, but do you want to go on many dates? Oh boy, um, I'm not supposed to date students. Oh, for any moment. Oh, <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> but I just feel something inside. Oh boy, oh, I'm really uncomfortable. <laughs> we can't be together. It won't work. <laughs> We're from two different worlds. Oh boy, I'm uncomfortable. Sir, all right. Do you know about the staff meeting tonight? <laughs> um, yo, si, caliente. Oh, I'm confusing my countries. Cousin. <laughs> Okay, there's two hearts of a friend. One, two, three, four, okay, we're ready. Two. Hey, come on in. Get down, I'm meaning to talk to you. Sit down. Oh, oh. This is your house, but sit down anyway. <laughs> Thanks for inviting me in. You're off the course. I'm gonna put it bluntly. Ask for any moment. Oh no! <laughs> See, you're kind of weirding out everybody else. Show me that. But no. Hey, you know where I can find some Maya Newt? <laughs> Dylan Morgan, you're an odd duck. Maybe Gecko Scales? <laughs> Boss? Yeah. He's Pair of a newborn? He's doing it again. Go back! Don't worry, I'll get you back somehow. Hey, just uh, watch your eyes. Over I'm alright, I'm alright. You know, keep them shielded. You know, I can't move my neck to the right ever since the accident. Show me that! <laughs> I get knocked down, and I get up again. Who sings that? Go back! <laughs> Call back. Oh! introduce to you our newest staff member, our new British literature oi, professor, oi. Mr. Jones. Uh, aye, aye, aye. Yeah, Mr. Uh, Jones. You have the floor. Go ahead. Oh, thank you. He um, is muy attractivo. <laughs> uh, 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 thanks, m'lady. Bonjour. Oh. Okay, guys. We're together, so just back off. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Are you with the staff Yo, meeting? this is a staff meeting only, no student. That's so spicy. You told me I could come. No, I did, I did not. Show me that. So I can come? No, you can't come. It's a I'll staff. I'll be there. It's, uh, go, go back. Go back. Hey, Mr. Jones, I'm going to give you a break. You're new. They, this is your first staff meeting, but in the future, you cannot invite students. De nada. Right. La cucaracha. Dylan, welcome to the coven. Didn't I kill you? <laughs> we brought him back. Didn't Together. I kill both of you? It might have been people who look like us. <laughs> we wear skin suits. <laughs> That's absolutely true, we do that. We're witches. We cut off people's skin and wear it. Show me that! <laughs> hey guys. Oscar winning moment. <laughs> why, why, why you got all those knives? <laughs> You're the most beautiful person I've ever met. Hey, thanks. <laughs> There's nothing about hey, what's you. what's up with these ropes? <laughs> do you exfoliate? I do. I have... Do you exfoliate? Yep. Yep. Ah, oh, hey. Oh, wow. It's, oh, you're being a little rough. Why are you being so rough? Go back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then we cut his throat. And drained he... all the blood out. Took the skin. He doesn't need to hear all of it. I'm just oh. very confused. Right now. We heard you were a witch. We wanted you here. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm a warlock. Well, you talked to, to Mr. Jones. Huh? Well, I mean, he had kind of a Northeastern accent in his interview. I thought he was from Boston, but now he's... I, have you heard him talk at all? How does he talk around you? Like a pirate. <laughs> Show me that. <laughs> What be? Just what? take it. Just take it. Thank you, back. 
I'm scared of him a lot of the time. A pirate. I mean, he sounded like a like a British guy when I talked to him. Well, I actually, mean, pirates are sort of with like a British a accent. British. Okay, so I don't know if everybody else went to high school with like theater geeks, but there's this thing that I feel like most of them do, where you just pick up accents willy nilly. And the two big ones were, of course, pirate and British, which apparently we're doing in this show. Um, so it's a return to high school, but. It was really weird at my high school because you could tell the people who were like Pirates of the Caribbean versus like Harry Potter fandom, and they would fight with each other during class. Like they'd be like, I've got a cadaver, and then I've got no rum. <laughs> Oi class, I moved the chalkboard to this side of the classroom to the port bow section. <laughs> Oi! You a cop? Harry uh, 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 Potter's today's lesson. Harry Potter, student in the back. <laughs> so I decided to observe his class to kind of get to the bottom of what was going on, and it's so much weirder than I imagined. Mr. Jones? Yes, how can I help you? <laughs> uh, I know my birthday was last week, but I... Arnold! 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 Yes, happy Close enough. I, I brought, I brought but, in banana pudding. I brought up some for everybody. Inner monologue. Mmm, <laughs> banana pudding. <laughs> And we, we kind of discussed a little bit earlier like that we wouldn't do a whole big thing, but he told me that he was going to get me like a bunch of gifts and some flowers and it was going to be really sweet. So I went through all of the trouble of doing like this huge big thing, like he loves gummy candy. So I went to the candy shop at the mall and I got him like three pounds of gummies and I drew him this handmade like booklet card and he shows up yesterday, empty hand. <laughs> And I hand off this big bag of gummies, totally. and he's just like, I love you. Yeah. How the hell do I respond to, I love you? I mean, I have to feel good about it, right? This is Eric. <laughs> he has a wife and three or four beautiful children. Liberation, thank you so much for coming to our show. Uh, we had a great time. I hope you had a good time. We had a really fun time up here. Um, really quick, few things. We have another show next Friday, same place, same time, 8.30 p.m. with the Ship of Fools. Woo! If you like what you saw, you want to do it with us, we have an open practice. The Sunday following next Friday. 24th. The 24th. <laughs> the Sunday. At 1 p.m. in Lily Hall here on campus. So if you want to show up to 3418. 3418 is 34, the room number. Uh, we've been at Liberation with uh, Taylor, Matt, Shanna, Katie, Will, and Mike. I almost forgot his name. And uh, you can check us out at adliberation.net. We also have some new members. Uh, if they're in the audience, could they stand up, please? Newbies, stand up! Yes. We have some other new members, but they couldn't be here tonight for whatever reason. So give them a round of applause. And we'll see you guys later.